Another day, another bed bug found in the subway. Metropolitan Transportation Authority officials have been very reluctant to talk about bed bugs in the transit system. It's a story they wish would just go away. So we'll rely on undercover transit sources to bring you the first ever bug stat. There were at least 21 reported bed bug sightings or encounters in the subway in August, including a few incidents in which a bloodsucker bit a conductor or a rider, sources said. According to these transit insiders, there were nine sightings on N trains, three on Q trains and two on number six trains. The itch-inducing insects also were spotted once each on nose. Three, four, five and Dell trains, the sources said. In addition to riding the rails, bedbugs were found in transit worker crew rooms and subway offices in Astoria, Queens, and Coney Island, Brooklyn, and and Q lines, and Euclid Avenue, East New York, also in Brooklyn, a line. We've never had sightings to this magnitude, said Joe Costels, a chairman with Transport Workers Union Local 100. We've had isolated incidents in crew quarters, but it's no longer an isolated scenario. It's throughout the system. A couple of transit workers believe they have unwittingly brought bedbugs home from the job. The MTA has steadily downplayed the significance of its insect ridership. It's just a small part of life in the big city, officials contend. The subway system has 5.5 million riders every single day and we can't check all of them for bedbugs before letting them on the train, MTA spokesman Adam Lisberg said in early August. That said, when we get reports of bedbug sightings, we investigate and exterminate. This is an interesting story but not a big problem.